So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna jump on this new horse really quick. Eating grass. But he's let you jump up. Whoa. <laughs> hey farm fam, welcome back to my channel. And for those of you that are new, welcome. Good morning. <laughs> That was like perfect timing, the rooster crowing. It is morning time. And in my last video, I accidentally spoiled that there was some new horses in our pasture. So I can't keep this secret for long. So today I'm going, oh my gosh, Dobby, he's running in the back. So today I'm going to tell you about these horses in my pasture. And there's three horses, so we need to talk about, are they new horses or where did they come from? So we're gonna talk about that today. But when you guys are watching this video, I will be on my way to pick up Cash. So in the next video, you guys will see us bringing home Cash, introducing him to the herd, including the three new horses. And I'm super excited. If you guys are excited for Cash, go ahead right now, put in the comments that you are excited. Just write, I'm excited for Cash or whatever you want, something about Cash right now because I wanna know who's excited to see Cash because I'm super excited. Dommy, you're going crazy. Ever since we have moved here, Domino has like been so crazy. He runs around the pasture like a nut job. But let's get into showing you guys who these new horses are. All right, so I need to call him up for feeding. So you guys briefly saw what's going on right here. Trigger is so ready to eat. He, he's got this figured out. He's like, if I stand here, I know I'm gonna eat. <laughs> So these are our panels from our round pen and we don't have the barn yet like I explained in my last video and made four stalls and they just go in here for feeding so that no one's fighting over feed or anything like that. So it works out pretty perfect. They are eating down the grass all right here on the fence line. Are you ready? Trigger usually eats in this stall so he's standing right by it. So I want to go ahead and show you guys how we get them into their stalls. And um, when the new horses pop up over here, we can show you them. Be nice, Trigger. Please, you have so many burrs in your hair. Oh, buddy, we gotta get those out. We gotta get those out. Oh, look, and this is this is one of the new horses right here. It's a mini. <laughs> and this one, too. Okay, now no, there's two. So now I just need to find the third one for you. Oh, there's the third one right there. So when you guys were asking about the white and brown um, horse, it was actually black, white and black, and it's right there. Trigger, we're not doing this again. <laughs> you cannot stand in front of the camera and not let me show anything. Just kidding, you guys, but <laughs> they all came in at a good time, so. All right, you guys, right behind my hand are the new horses. <laughs> are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Oh, I'm so excited to show you guys. Okay, here we go, and I'm gonna go with the one that most of you guys talked about. Here we go, boom. This is X, and X is a paint, and he is super dirty right now. Were you rolling, buddy? Were you rolling? Look how dirty he is. Hi, Bubba's. Are you eating the grass? So this is X, X is such a sweet boy. And then, we need to go into another one. Oh, here we go. Spear, spear! This is an encounter. Spirit and Dommy. Dommy left. Spirit, are you being camera shy? Are you being camera shy? Look how pretty you are. Hi, Spirit. Spirit, you have burrs all up in your hair too. Hi, baby. Spirit is such a special horse. So he's super kind and he's actually a really good barrel horse. And the last but not least, the baby. And he's huge <laughs> and he is a baby. Come back, Cisco. So do we see Cisco here? So look who's next to him, Blaze. Do they not look so much alike? So I wish Trigger would walk around, but he wouldn't <laughs> because that's Trigger. But Cisco literally looks like a combination of Blaze's color and Trigger's height and then like the size of Trigger's stripe down his face. But fun little fact, Cisco! <laughs> Trigger, did you just make Cisco run away? So it's super cool. Cisco's actually going into the woods right now. So we're in the woods here and this is Cisco, like I said. And back there is Spirit. So we're just gonna follow them here into the woods. It's so cool back here. But, fun fact, Cisco is one month younger 
than cash. So I'm so excited for them to meet because they're both babies and it's just so fun. And look how wild this is. Are we in the forest? Look at that. Kitty, kitty. It's so cool. Ow, Trigger, you bumped into me. That was rude. That was pretty rude, Trigger. That was pretty rude. Is this cool back here? And there's my Louie. Lulu, he's been doing it so good here, you guys. He surprisingly isn't as like scared of things here. So, it's been really good for him. Triggy, are you headed to the woods? With your dirty butt? Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Let's blaze. Into the woods he goes. Look who's meeting you at the woods. Trigger. Trigger. Hi, cute boy. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna jump on this new horse really quick. So he is such a sweet boy, he totally doesn't even care that I'm on him right now. And he's just chilling, eating grass. Stand, stand. Good boy, throw that leg over, Mike. Stand. Good boy, he's not gonna go anywhere. It's a good boy. Mike is playing with Trigger and he's actually complying. This is the first time that he's done this. That he's let you jump up. Oh! <laughs> you scared him, you spoke too soon. <laughs> Trigger doesn't really love to be jumped on like, like bareback without like a halter or anything like that. I think he thinks it's unnatural. He's like, if I am not haltered <laughs> or hooked up with any type of Attack. I am not supposed to be ridden. <laughs> okay. A little bit of groundwork there. Cute boy. All right, Triggs. Are you a little brat? Okay. So we're going to go ahead and try to get them all ready to eat and fed. So now we must call into the woods. All right. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Come on out of the woods. The cows. Come on, Triggs. So Trigger gets the first stall. So this is how we do it. This is the only stall that's kind of like a pain. Let me take this out. See if I can do this with one hand because usually I can hardly do it with two hands. Guys, I indeed cannot do this with one hand. So I need some assistance from Mike. <laughs> okay, thank you. Trigger, you have to get your ball. You knocked the ball down. Oi, come on. Lou? Come on, Lou! Why don't you want to go in? Alright, ladies, you're going in then. Come on, Lou! Good boy. Good boy. Alright. So, it's kind of dark in here. But this is like the shed that we have been feeding in. And these are all the buckets, buckets for the new horses right there. And this is kind of how we have it all set up. And then the cats over there eat. Everyone's here except Peach right now. But this is how we have it all set up. So Mike is gonna go ahead and get all the feed scoops ready. But it's time we talk about where these new horses came from. So. So they are not my horses. I hate to break it to you guys. I wish they were my horses. Um, actually, one day maybe Spirit will be ours, maybe in some far, far future, because Mike absolutely loves Spirit. So maybe one day in life, I don't know. I don't think my friend will ever get rid of him though, so probably will never happen. But anyways, I just set up my friend. They are actually my friend's horses, and they are kind of just boarding their horses here for right now. They actually have property that they are clearing, just like how we've been clearing ours. So I actually met them at like the second place that I ever boarded, and we just became really good friends, and that was over two years ago. So it's really fun to actually have them here because I feel like we're boarding again, and that was one thing I always missed from having our own property to boarding our horses was the people and just always having someone to ride with or having someone that could feed your horses if you couldn't or something like that so I don't know it's just one thing that I always missed about boarding and it's kind of fun like I said because it's like we're in a boarding stable again so it's really cool they're really easy and all my horses know these horses so 
it worked out really nicely. There was no like introduction period because they boarded together. We ride all the time together. But the only one who hasn't really ever been pastured together is Cisco, because he's a baby with my horses. And Cash, my baby, <laughs> has never been with Spirit X or Cisco. So I'm interested to see how he does. He'll be fine though, because he has our herd already. So there's really no issues there, but I'm so excited to see how he acts with Cisco. Because like I said, Cisco is literally one month younger than him. So I'm so excited. They've never met before, but to have two babies, they're both three years old. So to have two babies on the property is gonna be so fun. And then, um, but we do have all the horses in this pasture, like the horse pasture, but I think I am gonna open up the cow pasture and maybe put two horses over there just to alleviate some of the grass. I don't know, but I did spoil this in my last video. So I had to tell you who these horses are. They are not my horses, but they will be here at the farm for the next couple months. So you may see them again in another video. And we've got our feed already. Side note really quick, this is what it looks like, kind of, um, when we do this. So, and then we have to come back and do another round. And then we drop this, and then we have to come back and do a whole nother round, so. All right, you guys, so if you like this video, make sure you go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below. Make sure you turn on that post notification so that you have a chance to be my next post notification shout out, and so that you don't miss any of my other videos. That being said, today's post notification shout out goes to, all right, you guys, I love you, and I'll see you in the next one.